What's up, rascals? Did you miss me? I hope so, because if it didn't, that kind of solidifies my solitude and loneliness. <laughs> hey, the amazing Rando! Watch Rando the Great construct sets with his very mind! <laughs> thought a lot this weekend about um, the direction I want the channel to go. Uh, it's probably not gonna get me anywhere anytime soon being a Let's Play channel and uh, whatever because I from the start I wanted it to be a Let's Play channel even before I, I even before I finally bit the bullet and decided that I wanted to do a, a YouTube channel. All right, here's the real thing. Ever since I started this channel, it's been all Let's Plays, uh, with the idea that occasionally I'd throw in a skit or two. But that's gotten redundant because I've focused so much more time on Let's Plays and haven't set aside any time for even thinking about skits or, or other such. Bibble babble. Bibble babble? Is that a word I should use? I used it once. Fuck it. Since I started the channel, my focuses have kind of shifted and fluctuated. I've I've begun collecting consoles again. I've pursued methods of uh, improving the video quality, editing tricks techniques and uh, and there's no other way to say this I want more later in the week you're gonna see a video that I've worked on the entire weekend I know sounds kind of weird I'm working on one video for an entire weekend hopefully once you see it you'll understand and you'll love it as much as I enjoyed making it cuz <laughs> the, the, the entire process was just how do I explain this? It's kind of cliche, but it, it it was invigorating. I mean, it was taking a step outside of what I normally do and figuring out, okay, how am I going to get this going? How what am I going to do next? How how am I going to interact with this? And I know I'm, I'm speaking really cryptic about it because I don't want to spoil any surprises, but at the same time, I want I want to share with you guys all, all the thoughts and uh, stuff that was going through my head. And I can't even process the thoughts that are going through my head right now. It's, it's such a weird contrast because last week my... My mind was just clouded over, and this week, it's it's just a mess of noise, and I don't I don't know how to process it all. And but at the same time, I almost want to say it feels good. Nope, can't 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 think of it. Can't explain it. <laughs> There's something else that I wanted to address, like, I, I, I don't know how to get into it, so I'm just gonna dive right in and uh, hope for the best. But the comments on last week's video where I said that, hey guys, I'm not, I'm not feeling very well up here, and I'm not gonna lie, I'm not gonna mince words, it felt good to see that outpouring of support from you guys, but... One comment in particular really struck a chord with me. Jesse, for many skills, I wanted to say thank you so much for that message. I can't really explain it, because it... That seems to be my problem right now, is that I can't explain anything I'm thinking or feeling. But, um... That last sentence... In your comment just no seriously I cannot explain it but it 
I almost want to say it had kind of a healing effect. So that just goes to show you how powerful words can be. Just a quick little positive message to somebody can have an unforeseeable effect. And that is freaking beautiful. I'm not gonna lie. And I'm not gonna... I'm not going to apologize for the way I worded that. I might have to apologize for rambling like an idiot, but I don't see that happening anytime soon. I'm sorry for how sappy this next line is going to to come across, but I, I really mean it. Thank you, all of you, for being a part of this journey with me. It really is. This is a trip, knowing that you guys have my back. And all I do is make stupid little videos on the internet. Another thing that I learned over the weekend is that, uh... Yeah, my suspicions were right. I am not doing enough for this channel, or for you guys. Uh... <laughs> listening to the uh, H3 podcast uh, with Jack Septicai as the guest, he was talking about all the stuff that goes on behind the scenes for him, and I need to uh, really pick up the pace and uh, quit slacking off. <laughs> yeah, I know this. Ch I've this channel is just for fun at this stage, and I'm I shouldn't think too much about it. But I really do want to take this seriously. I want I want this to be a bigger part of my my life, my routine. Maybe not my my routine. I don't want it to. I don't want to get stuck in a rut, but... Hey, that rhymes. I do want this channel to evolve. That's what I'm trying to say. I want the channel to, to change and grow for the better, and, uh... I want to entertain you guys more, and why am I dancing like it's Saturday Night Fever? Even with that all said, um, there might be a few times where there's a, where there's a lull in content, where I'm, where... I miss a day or two of scheduling. I've decided that I want to try and figure out and focus on a, f on a few more skit ideas than I have been. Because, like I said earlier, there's, I've wanted skits to be a part of the channel. I wanted this to be for entertainment as much as I, I do gaming content. But I've been so focused on the games and Let's Plays that I've just put all the other ideas that I had for the channel like on a shelf off to the side and I just said, I'll do that later when I have more time. And I end up and I've ended up creating a situation where I never have the time. And if I don't do something about it now, that might end up staying the same, and I don't like that idea. I I I I, 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 I want to do what I can to make things change for the better and improve things. Yes, I still want to do let's plays, but I don't want that to be like this cage trap that I've stuck myself in. Speaking of the let's plays, I've been debating on changing up how I do the scheduling format. Uh but really, I'd like your input on it before just deciding I'm just going to change everything up and make it a drastic mess. Here's my idea. So as you've seen, I usually do one video a day, and each day is a different game. But that might end up dragging out the Let's Play a little too, too long for you guys. I don't know. So I've been thinking about lessening that by focusing on a single game and putting out episodes of that daily, rather than once a week. So maybe you get two or three videos of the same game, then the next two days are different videos entirely. I don't know. Um, I don't even know if I'm explaining this right. I need a flowchart! Long story short, uh, would you rather see me do the format that I've been doing, where I have a different video and a different game each day? Or would you prefer that I focus on fewer games and put out the episodes sooner, like almost daily? That's my question for you guys. 
let me know in the comments if, which you'd prefer or if you have a preference. And also, maybe uh, if there's a game series that you'd prefer that I focus more on, let me know. Or if I should find different games entirely. Well, that's going to be it for me today. Hope you guys have a good rest of your week, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Hopefully, it'll amaze. This vlog brought to you by the trombone.